Good morning students of grade 9. This is our lesson number 4. It's about two bargains and you know very well that we already did uh, three questions before in our last lesson. So now today we are going to proceed further. This is question number 4. How did the two learn a bitter lesson? Bitter means a harsh lesson, right? The Jew learned a bitter lesson because he was expecting much profit from the deal, but he was disappointed as he m made none at all. As the Jew, he was expecting that I'll, I'll earn m more from this um, deal, but he was disappointed that he made none at all. Question number five, what is the role of generosity in Islamic history? Like in Islamic history, what is the rule of generosity? The answer is in Islamic history, we can find out a lot of good examples of generosity. It's a lengthy question, so you have to pay attention that make it sure you write each and every point. Our Holy Prophet وسلم, was known for his generosity even before prophethood. His enemies expected nothing but generosity from him. Nothing depicts this better than when he was cast out of the city of Taif with blood flowing from the wounds after being stoned in the streets. Still, it was the generosity of our holy prophet وسلم, that he prayed for them. He did not curse the people of the city of Taif. In fact, he prayed for them. Our holy prophet وسلم, used to fill the buckets of water in the house of an old woman who used to throw rubbish on him. After the conquest of Makkah, our holy prophet spared the lives of Quraysh. He, peace be upon him, him even forgive Abu Sufyan, who was the worst enemy of our holy prophet and Islam. Abu Sufyan, he was known to be the very uh, like uh, to be the worst enemy of uh, our holy prophet and Islam even our holy prophet spared his life moreover our holy prophet peace be upon him never turned anyone away empty handed from his house you know very well that he never turned anyone away empty handed from his house the followers and companions of a holy prophet, peace be upon him, also set very good examples when it comes to generosity. When it comes to generosity, we have a lot of examples in the history of Islam, but we are going to mention a few of them because our answer is going to be very lengthy then. In the expedition of the book, Hazrat Usman, Razia Talan, who bore one third of the expenses of the Muslim army, Hazrat Abu Bakr gave all his wealth while Hazrat Umar gave half of his wealth. Hazrat Usman Raziya who was known for his generosity, when Muslims migrated to Medina, so they faced a lot of problems in getting sweet water. Because there was only one well of sweet water which belonged to a Jew. And this story is mentioned in your textbook as well. Hazrat Usman paid for that well and did, did, dedicated that to the people of Medina which still exist and is called as Bere Usman. Now you have to do your homework and that is do all these question answers in your neat notebooks. It, it should be very neat and tidy. Thank you so much.